This is the building of a burned down school. The main school in Stanitsa Luhanska burned down because of the bombings. One of the locals collect all the burned roofing. Vigantas paints the consequences of the war on the frontline city of Stanitsa Luhanska. He's been in Ukraine for a week now. He came from Vilnius to participate in the project. The artist says that in January 1991 he took part in the events surrounding Lithuania's secession from the Soviet Union. Now he decided to use his art to support a country which is fighting for its territorial integrity. Ukraine did not start this war. It did not instigate it. Ukraine is not the aggressor. Lithuanian painter Greta depicts the war through symbols in her paintings. For example, this clock represents how time has stopped in Stanitsa Luhanska. This painting has a lot of symbols and different characters. Time. A cat that lives here. The man has my love. The color red represents the trial that people face right now. The ideological organizer of the project is Fedir, an artist from Kyiv. He invited friends from Lithuania to participate in a joint artistic project on the front lines. Three responded to his call. In Ukraine, Fedir found two more like-minded people. Together they painted for a week in Stanitsa Luhanska. They completed six large paintings and dozens of small ones. The project was financed by the Lithuanian embassy. On the other bank of the Siversky Donetsk River there is a very strange territory from which people are coming to Europe. And the question is, what awaits them here, here in Europe? Because they are coming from a strange place over a broken bridge. Stanitsa Luhanska is the gate to Europe. This is the end of that world and the start of a new European world. The artists live in a vacation complex. It was built just before the war. War has left its mark on every building here. Fedor says that he tried to convey this in his paintings. I was astonished by the bullet holes that are everywhere here and the gashes from shrapnel. The gates that you go through when you pass to Nitsa Luhanska have bullet holes that look like stars. Even the room where we live has a bullet hole in the window. The works created by the artists will be exhibited in Lithuania and later in Ukraine. Reported by Anastasia Volkova for UATV.